All right, ladies and gents, welcome back to my retrospective special event uh, for July of 2020. I've had a lot of fun so far uh, with this event. Last last portion, I almost peed myself. I was laughing so hard at some of the funny stuff. To, right now, what we're going to do, we are going to watch some gameplay from 2011. This is the Assassin Cre Assassin's Creed Revelations multiplayer beta gameplay. All right. Um... From 2011, September 3rd, 2011. I was told there's a very funny All right, here they come. moment People in this filling video. up the room. Okay. I'll be the book, this guy again. The French killer. The dick. This is loud. Hold on. I'm going to lower it. What is this one called? It's too loud. Wanted. I think it's the same thing, dude. That's what? As the one we just did. Deathmatch? I don't think it's any different. Do this. What? Why is it called something else then? Where's that? It's called Wanted. What the fuck? I don't know. You like that guy, huh? He's got a big fucking club. I love it. He's beach people with him. Fancy outfit going. Haha, uh, <laughs> 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 see, I'm burping back then. Nine years ago, I burped too. I guess so. Huh. So there's a glitch supposedly four minutes in, but we'll, we'll watch the beginning of it too. Oh, yeah, you got the compass now. Okay. You gotta head towards your target. Not get detected. Okay. okay, this is way different. Yeah. See, here comes some people. I knew this. The room will fill up. Contract lost. Great. Contract Rapid. lost. Congratulations. So is the oh, oh shit! Oh, this is the circle fills up. It kill. means that you're getting towards your target, but people could kill you from behind too. Oh, I remember this. I don't know. So for those who don't remember, Assassin's Creed actually used to have multiplayer. This is way back in the day. This is nine years ago. Brotherhood and Revelations had multiplayer, where you would play as a character, various different characters who had different abilities and different assassination styles, and you would try to blend in with crowds to become camouflage, but then you could sneak in and out of the crowds to try to assassinate your targets. It was actually fun. I really liked the multiplayer of both Assassin's Creed's that had it. And then they just dumped it. They just completely dumped it and never went back to it for whatever reason. I don't know why. Um, but I really enjoyed it. Um, so thank you, DSP and Wings, for the cheers. Um, Alicia only just says both were good, but both were good good in glitches. This game is buggy, a buggy mess before launch. And this is the beta we're playing. This is the multiplayer beta. Hmm. Yeah, it's a different map. Yeah. Okay. It tell you if they're in your line of sight, I guess. You have to kind of... You have to figure it out. You just have to follow the compass. Yeah, no, but the compass doesn't tell you how close they are, not if they can see you. Right. right. So it is a little different. You gotta go all the way across the map to find this guy. See, it's filling up. That means you're getting closer to your target. I remember. That's brutal, man. Steps head off. Up. What the fuck? She's on the roof. Yeah. Same guy. Okay. You need to try to stay inconspicuous so no one knows that you're a, a human-controlled character. There she but goes. you also She's need to be able to maneuver her to kill your target. Map? Yeah, it's a completely different map. Get this slut! Oh, I jumped in the hay! We <laughs> jumped in the hay. So, you may listen, and you may hear Rambo is saying, is doing different commentary, or asking me what I'm talking about. That's because Rambo is not watching me. Back then, we did this really neat thing. I would have two setups. I would actually have two console setups. One was on the main TV, and one was a side TV with a monitor. Like, I use these monitors now on my PC. So, Rambo would be set up here. And I'd be set up here. We'd be playing next to each other. We would do co-op playthroughs, co-op commentary. We would do playthroughs like that, which was really neat. We could do multiplayer, or we could just do games where you could hook over the internet and do, like, co-op campaign. And we did a lot of fun stuff like that back then. It's funny, because now there's almost nothing that's like that. Like, how many games can you say, oh, there's a co-op campaign and have people join you over the internet? There's not that many. Uh, but back then, there were a lot. So we used to do this. It was pretty neat. A pretty neat thing that we would do. Oh, there's a new multiplayer game. You sit here, I sit here, we do it next to each other. You see, it's pretty neat. And yeah, Dude Frozen, that's how we did Dead Space 3. That's right, we did Dead Space 3 sitting next to each other like that. Um, 
it was it was really fun. I I wasn't aware that many other people did stuff like that back then. So it was pretty unique. <clears throat> GSP and Wings no follower mode will not be turned off. No. Okay, let's continue. Oh, I get to do that. Fuck. Well, she got away. Yeah. Well, I fucked up pretty bad. <laughs> I don't know what you're doing. Not even close. Oh my god. Oh, thanks. I, I'm I, I'm glad to hear you're enjoying the retrospective thing, Michael. Damn, she did it again. Ah, she got away. Top of the this is the chase mode, remember? If, if you alert the target, you have to huh. cash them or else you lose the contract. Uh, right, right, right. You have to chase them. Uh -oh. like five after me. There's glitches coming <laughs> up. Guys Who's having a guy. nice. The guy's coming after me. Escape. Roll to the hills. Run to the hills. I just fucked that guy. Stay hidden. I go target. Nice. Escape. Sweet. Escaped. Shell Connor said he really liked my Marvel Ultimate Alliance 1 and 2 playthroughs. Sure. Yeah. I remember. We played 2 as a new release. There's an annoying guy who's running into One we played later, I believe. What the fuck? What's that? <laughs> shit today. What on earth? <laughs> that was that was why that stuff was so funny back then. That was seriously why that stuff was so funny. John would do co-op. We, we would know, never know what was going to happen. Shit was full of bugs. It was full, hilarious. It was freaking hilarious, man. Oh my god. Alright. <clears throat> that was good. Whoever nominated that one, that was a good one. The turkey bug. Okay, what's next? <laughs> oh, let's see here. So, in 2011, we went to uh, New York Comic Con at the Javits Center in New York City. They probably won't have another New York Comic Con for another 12 years, the rate that we're going with coronavirus at this point. Um, but back then, uh, we would go to these trips, and I would always film everything. I would film every single moment of everything that we did, Right? And at this point, this is our arrival at the Javits Center. I can either watch the whole thing or people are actually saying that about halfway through, uh, there's some funny stuff. Maybe we'll just watch the whole thing. Shout out to Nye Morgan, who did a 300 bit cheer. Thank you, Nye Morgan, for the cheer. I appreciate that. All right, let's see. Let's see what this is. Come on. Right. Hitting a pedestrian? Oh, God. So this is October 15, 2011. Yeah, hey, we hit a pedestrian off camera. Oh, no, we didn't. All right, so we are in New York City. We are on the way to the Javits Center. <clears throat> oh shit, an umbrella! Yeah, look at that, an umbrella symbol right there. Oh yeah, they're gonna be. There's gonna be a big Arkham City uh, 
There's video going up there. Shit. right there on the right. Oh There's shit! There's gonna be a big, um, a big uh, Batman um, video probably when we get to the center. Yeah, he doesn't know what he's doing. He knows Arkham he's City. Watching. That was before Arkham <laughs> City even came out. Damn. Look at this. Evil what? Oh, it's for the game up version. Yeah. yeah. Oh god, that game was terrible. <laughs> I think it's March. I think I'm supposed to stop it, here. Right? I think so. I stop here, right? No, you can't block the box, right? The I'm supposed thing. to stop here, aren't I? Guys, come on. No, look what they're doing. Oh, fuck the we now. Come on, dude. <laughs> you don't. It, it, there's. It, you don't stay in the middle of the intersection out of red do. light. Yes, That's do. terrible. That's exactly what. Yes, you, you do. do. Oh look, I let the. Oh gosh, these people who drive like silly people are in front of us. Bad man. For those who don't recognize the voice, that's OJ, also his other John, because both he and John are named John. But that is John's best friend for pretty much his entire life. And he used to also do stuff with us from time to time. He was our travel companion for conventions and the like, and he's driving in this one. <clears throat> Garden to me a dollar I have hands at the ends of my arms. It's good to hear. Normal human design, you should have hands at the end of your arms. So that's that, that's nice to know. Thank you, Garden, for a dollar tip. Um... Shell Khan artist said, I remember ha having to use those Garmin GPSs before smartphones. That's right. You may notice there's a GPS unit in the car. You're like, what the hell do you need that for? Well, you don't anymore. But back then, not every smartphone had built-in GPS, so. Yeah, on Tuesday, did you know that? Nine years Batman ago. Batman Arkham City. Everyone that shows up to come will get it for free today. Wow. Excellent. I think it's true. Uh, I'm just going to go in there assuming that. Yeah, my hopes so. up. It's not true. I'm going to go into a rage. <laughs> oh, gosh. <laughs> a ranting rage. Oh, this is the perfect time to be doing road maintenance. In front of a giant convention. Right in front of, you know, the busiest day of the year I for the Javits Center. Look at this guy, we're gonna hammer it away. Got that? Yeah. <laughs> I feel like he <laughs> took <laughs> Rush <laughs> apart and he just kept the piston. Got some Teamsters doing some work. <laughs> nice Teamsters. Whoa, 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 Oh, look, there's a big sign for Ultimate Marvel 3 right in the fucking front. Oh, boy. Jesus. I was up posters and bags yesterday. For that game? Yeah, and that yeah. Batman thing's been running since Thursday. Oh, Batman, Batman thing? Batman is... The big video. Oh, this is uh, Arkham City promo yeah. video? No, that's the movie, right? The new movie? Huh? Oh, it's like live action... Oh, it's... No, that's the game, dude. Holy shit. <laughs> what graphics going on? Yeah, it says Arkham City at the end. <clears throat> Batman, Arkham City. So Batman, here's... Batman, fuck your mother. Pretty... Whoa. 11. <laughs> what the hell? Anyway. <laughs> anyway. Yeah, first of all, driving in New York City is as dangerous as we just saw. People will literally just walk in front of your car and don't give a fuck. So if you're driving in, um... If you're driving in New York City, you always have to be very careful about where you're going what you're doing because people will just jump right out. And then you're liable if you hit them. Um, this was cool because, you know, seeing your, your hobby... And at this point, 2011, it was my job for the first year that I was doing it as a job. To see that as, like, a giant hyped thing was really cool. And, you know, going to the Javits Center and you see Marvel, Ultimate Marvel 3, you know, Arkham City, uh, uh, you know, Resident Evil. You see, you're like, oh my god, this is all the stuff I love, and this is, like, a giant event for it. It's pretty neat. Dark Souls. Batman That's in. not Dark Souls. Batman in Dark Souls 3. <laughs> There's an L.A. Noir van. That's pretty funny. No one cares about that game anymore. Oh, sweet. I'm Victory Walking Dead. Walking Dead. Right. Back when it was super popular in 2011, right? Is this my left? I can't tell. No, there's more chat. Like, 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 right yeah, we're going to the, uh, oh gosh, oh gosh, why did I pay this much parking? This is, it was a horse and buggy coming down. Nice! Huh? I am. Oh, what the frell, lady? Fuck. Oh, okay. It's the horse and buggy from, guy, from Ghostbusters. Okay, it's a guy. I'm sorry, yeah. sir. Tiny horse and buggy. But seriously, that looked like uh, a horse that's probably kept in uh, turbo. Oh, Walking like Dead was in 2011. Yeah, it didn't Walking Dead start 2010. Season one was like 2010 or 2011. It was basically with the height of it was just getting super white hot popular when it started. Those first three four seasons were like super duper popular, right? I can't tell. You can move in if you have to. Are you trying to turn left? No. Are you okay? I want to go to the end. Can we open the window? No. Hello, beautiful butterfly. It's dusty out here. Don't How you doing? Here. Here's the Javits Center. Giant crane on top of it. This is Bradley. Oh, hey, what are they doing? They're working on this place, huh? It's Bradley's shitty costume. <laughs> <laughs> it's a green face. Let me put some green face on and fucking go out. Oh my gosh, I gotta build my booth. 
Oh, a great casting. I'm gonna attempt to get into this Green Lantern shit. <laughs> At 10.30? Are you crazy? Shot, it's the debut of the uh, new animated shit. Turn the video up a little, or turn the video, turn the volume up a little bit, okay. And? Is it made by the same people who did Justice League? Mm -hmm. It is? Yeah, what's his face? Oh shit, okay, then it'll, name. it'll actually be good. Same guy that did Batman. Batman, um, Superman, and Justice League. Yeah. Oh wow. I can't remember the dude's name, he's gonna be there, like the producer. Watch this asshole. Okay, <laughs> you can go catch on fire. Watch this asshole. Oh, he's in a Lexus too? No, forget it, you're banned. Go away. Well, your car's like a, like a shabby car or something? No, but I get, luxury cars annoy me. I don't know, for some reason, if someone's in a luxury car, I instantly assume they're an a-hole. <laughs> Hello, PW Dunn. It's one step above, it's, it's like it's one step above a what? Civic. Mine? Is that what you just said? No, what? it's one step above a Civic. <laughs> what? It's not like I'm buying an effing Acura or anything. <laughs> Dude, this is a reliable car. So start the day if you're insulting me. That's how it is. They always bicker back and forth. It was funny. You're insulting Watch me. Out. You're making fun of me. Wow. Why are making fun of you? Arriving at Jacob K. Javits Convention Center. Hey, it's a bearded Ness. That's somewhat disturbing. Attendees, unsuspecting attendees getting recorded. Just look for the. Just look. For, just look for funky colored hair, and you can tell. Hey, it's Deadpool. Deadpool. There's oh, yeah. a lot of Deadpools. This is true. Nine Morgan just did a thousand bit cheers. I hope you're having a good day, Phil. Thank you, Nine Morgan, for the biggest cheer of the stream. I appreciate that. What was fun about this kind of stuff was this is the first time that I ever really did anything like this. Like I wasn't into conventions, I wasn't into any of this stuff. So from the years of like 2011, when I started doing this as a job, 2011 through like 2013, 2014, I went to a series of conventions that was fun for me to be exposed to that for the very first time. All right, this is our I can't lives. hear you. What? <laughs> what are you saying? John, shut up. I can't hear you. Seriously, <laughs> 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 just shut your mouth. Dude. What? Guys, come on. Is this the podiatrist convention? <laughs> <laughs> is this the guy to call? <laughs> I need someone to lance this wart. Where do I go? Unlock it. I can lock this window. <laughs> <laughs> if you treat me like a child, and act like one. You're already acting like one. I have nothing That's to That's it. Lose. Start pissing and shitting all over the yeah, seat. This is, chicken. this is where the Comic Con is. I don't know where we are. Is this the Star Trek convention? What you say? Is Jordy okay. LaForge inside? Wait, wait. Is this, is this? I can't tell. Is this? Oh my god. Street? It's whatever you want it to be, dude. <clears throat> you locked this window. Are you gonna let this That's guy great. in, or are you fucking? No. Oh my god. I hate driving in the city. You know this. <laughs> it's you make decisions. You, you make decisions. Man or you don't. It's crazy split second decisions. Here we go. This is it. This is where I wanted to park. Right, Everyone coming? It's one way street. It's a. Taxi. Whoops. Taxi didn't want to know where he was going. Wrong way. It's not a good idea with a taxi. He doesn't know what he's doing. I don't know if that parking's full. It looks like Traffic it might be. Oh, Traffic. Dang it. I don't think this park's full. This car's too expensive. 60 effing bucks. 60. Oh my god. Complete robbery. $60 to park your fucking car for like a few hours. Jesus, dude. That's terrible. $60. That's that's big city pricing for parking. It really is. It's a, it's a fucking highway robbery. I could swear I know some of these people. This guy. Awesome. And this was nine years ago. Today's probably like $85. It's Kingpin. It's the Kingpin. Yeah, that means he's 80% muscle, though. Yeah, I remember the King, oh, the King seeing the Kingpin explain why he's so fat looking. Okay. This body is 80% muscle, and then you like punch his spider across my window. window. I can't believe you were shouting at people. I wasn't shouting at people, I was just asking directions. I Scott Pilgrim, New York. <laughs> Excuse me. I Scott Pilgrim, New York. I fuck New York. Ah, <laughs> uh, yeah. Got Supergirl over there. You can check her out. What? Over there. Where? Oh, yeah. Near a Superman with no cape. She has the cape. She stole his cape. They couldn't have fun. <laughs> that guy's got a crazy X-Men jacket. They pooled their That's assets cool. together. She's got a hood on for... I don't know. It's not that cold. Turn this off. It's freezing. I was melting. <laughs> 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 All right, excellent. These guys are the best cosplayer. 
Evel Gibson says, if you could say something to your past self, what would you say? I would say enjoy and live in the moment because, you know, the things that I did back then are very different than what I do now. I, you know, things... My life was, was basically very different for the good and for the bad, all right? There were some things that were good and some things that were bad. And I'm glad that during that time period when I was really popular on YouTube and making money and doing all that stuff that I went and I kind of did stuff like this because, you know... It, it was it was temporary you know what i mean it wasn't something that was going to last forever and so being able to spend money to fly out places go places and do the stuff that i did was fun and it was one moment in my life that i enjoyed i'm much happier now i really am i'm much happier now but i'm glad that i enjoyed things in the moment back then when i could do these unique things you know what i mean there's over here on the right <laughs> construction nice they really look like real construction workers <laughs> All right, I guess that's it for that. That was pretty funny. I forgot about that. John just yells at someone out of the window and OJ freaked out. Okay, what else do we got? Uh, we got a few things here. I don't know if they're any good. Um, let's see. Apparently in Mass Effect 3, you guys remember Cortez, right? Um... But apparently, this was the extended cut DLC. This was when After Mass Effect 3 ended. People hated, absolutely fucking hated the ending of Mass Effect 3. To the point where people were so upset that months later, the makers of the game released a free DLC called the extended cut. In which they tried to basically kind of extend the ending. Okay. Um... In this clip, apparently not only do you have Cortez, you know, doing his thing with Shepard, but apparently, I guess, there's a glitch that's a, that's involved. Let's What's see. up, everyone? Dark Side Phil here, and I am very happy to... When, when, when is this? This was June 26, 2012. So this was just a little bit over eight years ago. God damn. Alice Telemann just cheers. It looks like you guys had a lot of fun anytime you did co-op or these trips. We did. Like I said, we had a good time. We had good chemistry. We had a good time. We liked hanging out with each other. To say that today we are returning to the world of Mass Effect 3 for the last time. And in fact, the world of Mass Effect for the last time until they decide to make a whole new spin-off series because you know they will to make more money. And I was absolutely correct. And it was just as bad as I suspected it would be with Andromeda. Good God. But... <laughs> Thank you, Derek. You this will be the nice last time we will be exploring the actual mainstream the? trilogy of games. And what we have today is called the Extended Cut DLC. It was released today. What this does is adds extra scenes and extra content onto, and hold on, I'm messing with my air conditioner here before we start, onto the game, starting with your final attack on the Cerberus base, leading all the way through your rescue of Earth, and the battle in London, and actually, the game now has four different endings, okay? Huh. So, our agenda, just so everyone knows exactly what we're doing here, um, I have galactic readiness of, I think, 5822, and, no, I'm sorry, I think I have f total military assets of 5822, galactic readiness of 55%, because I just played one game of multiplayer, and so that gives me a total or effective military assets of 3,200 per a Twitter, uh, a, tw a tweet from, I guess, oh one of the God. game developers, Mike Why Gamble so or something his name is. He said to get all the endings and the best versions of those endings, you only need 3,100 EMS. So I have it now. And so what we're going to do is we are actually going to replay the game starting from the mission where we actually go to Chrono Station and we assault the elusive Not man's too base, loud. Okay. okay. There's going to be scenes and things added in over the course of this that apparently are going go. to add to the ending Fix of the game. It. However, one thing that I have done that I want to make everyone aware that I did, I changed the difficulty to narrative, which is basically easy mode. Because bottom line is I've already beaten the game. I've done all this gameplay. I don't want to have to take 700 years to kill these enemies. So I basically put it on easy mode so we can kind of turbo through the action and get to the new scenes and see what happens. So without further ado... Let's do this. Let's get in here. Let's deliver most of the galaxy at war assets to the final conflict. I didn't even... Wait a minute. 
In my first playthrough of the game, I didn't get this. Nah. So they're absolutely right. They did lower the requirement, and I am going to get the best ending because this is showing the, the you only get this achievement if you're going to get the best ending. So cool. Wait a minute. What's this? No. Uh -oh. No. I forgot about this. No, not Cortez. No, we just wait. Oh uh -oh. no. Yeah. Oh no! Don't touch me. Oh. I was hoping you might want to wait together. I want to say. No, I didn't mean to say that. Until the call comes. Oh no. Oops. Of course. Not one moment for Brent. Oh! <laughs> Son of a bitch. Now, you notice what they did there. Unlike The Last of Us 2, they just faded the black before anything happened in a tasteful manner. Which Neil Druckmann doesn't understand, apparently. Okay. <sighs> Commander Shepard. Just saying. The trisexual. <laughs> He'll fuck any man, woman, or alien that wants his balls. Wow. One other thing, one last thing. I might get a, uh, might be interrupted during one, th uh, one video here. I'm actually expecting a delivery today, so if you're knocking on my door, you hear me turning off the camera it's because I'm answering the delivery. But uh, look at the screen. Wow. Apparently, I have, uh, I've locked up my console because of the gay scene that we just. Saw. <laughs> yeah. It I'm locked not up. Wow. My console just locked up. Are you serious? It wanted to give them more time. The console couldn't take <laughs> the gay kiss. It couldn't handle it. And my Xbox has been... <laughs> the red ring. That was it. I had to buy a new Xbox. Oh, my Xbox just fucking locked up. After, after Oh, my God. Hilarity ensues. This is great. What the fuck? Couldn't handle it. Wow. My, my, my Xbox said, no homo. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Wow. Well, thank you. Uh, uh, Amazing GT, how you doing, man? I know he said hello. Uh, I'm doing well. So far, the retrospectives were pretty fun today, for sure. Okay, um, well, that was a quick one. I thought that was going to be longer, but it was still funny. Um, let's see here. So, apparently, I don't know. This is a flat... Oh, wow, this is super old school. Let me take a look at this. Oh, my God. I didn't watch this one back. But this is Back to the Future, the game. You guys remember this? Back to the Future, the game. And this apparently is like... For the suit. So for those who don't know, Telltale Games. Anyone remember them? Anyone remember Telltale Games? I kind of do. So, Al oh, I almost said Atlas Telemann. Oh, uh, because he's, he's on the leaderboard here. Um, So back in the day, Telltale Games was known for making narrative style games most notably the walking dead but before they ever made the walking dead games they made a series of other games including jurassic park and a back to the future game that was a what if scenario what if the plot line of back to the future continued with marty mcfly and doc brown everyone around the same age you know which of course they could never do in the movies now because those guys are so old um so they did this what if game that I really enjoyed because I'm a fan of the Back to the Future trilogy. I really like those movies a lot. And what playing this game felt like it was like a fourth movie. It really did. And I really enjoyed this. Um, but I don't know. A few people actually said they they, they recommended this game. I, I believe it was. Damien El Mascador and Derek both recommended this game. I don't know how this is going to be. I don't know what this is a clip of. I guess I'm supposed to be watching it from about 7 minutes 40 seconds to about... 11 minutes, 55. Let's see what happens here. Delicious. <clears throat> so it looks like this is Marty. Who said you were worthy? In Fuck the past. you. Uh, Hieronymus Bosch, the old gray mayor, Joe Piscopo. These people don't exist yet. Bruce Springsteen. Doris Day. Take a hike, squirt. <laughs> Who said you were worthy? Uh. Boss Hog? Oh. Who said you were worthy? This is silly. You just keep saying the same thing over Am and over. I? <laughs> Who gave you the right to knock on my door? Could you repeat that? Who gave you the right huh. to knock on he my does. door? He does. I keep saying it. Will he keep saying it? Let's see. 
Could you repeat that? Who gave you the right <laughs> to walk on my door? It's a soft loop. You can't get out. Bosch? <laughs> Who is the king of Siam? This could take a long time. The king of Siam? Euronymous Bosch? <laughs> no. Nope. hilarious. Whoop. Who said you were worthy? The old gray mare? What will you do no. if I break your leg? Wait till Wednesday? <laughs> Who gave you the right to knock on my door? The old gray mare? God! Who told you to come here? Boss Hog? Who died Damn, I never, and did made I, you boss? Did I figure this out? Boss Hog? Boss Hog? What will you do oh. tomorrow? Wait till Wednesday. Wait till Wednesday? <laughs> no! That sounded <laughs> right and it a wasn't. Bunch of combinations to figure it out. Who is the king of Siam? Bruce Springsteen. Am I? What will you uh, do oh. when I send you away? Wait till Wednesday? Where do you want uh, to uh. be tomorrow? Fuck. <laughs> that show was I don't know. It's fucking, that's a James Bond oh. movie. Oh my Falcon god. Crest. <laughs> no, <laughs> yeah, so close. Fuck you. So close. Who died and made you boss? Boss Hog? What will you do when I send you away? Wait till Wednesday? Where you born? From Russia with love. Hill Valley. Fucking oh my god. Dicks. Who died? Takes forever. Boss. At least he's asking the same questions. Boss Hog? What will you do if I break your leg? Never mind. Jump for joy? Uh, Who said you were worthy? This is taking forever. The old gray mare? How did I figure what this will out? you do when I send you away? Getting closer. Wait till Wednesday? Where do you hang your hat? Ah. Uh. Ha Hattiesburg. Hattiesburg. Welcome to the yeah. oh. uh... I don't even know how you're supposed to figure that out. I wonder if there was clues in the game to let you know or if you just had to guess. Huh. Well, anyway, if you're interested in the old Telltale games, I never played the Jurassic Park one. I did play this one. And, of course, after Walking Dead, I played a ridiculous amount of them when they got popular and made them all before they went out of business. But this is a good one. If you, if you like Back to the Future, you should definitely watch my playthrough. I think it was five episodes. You definitely should check out that stuff because that was really a really fun game, in my opinion. It looks like, oh my god, looks like we're going to do more Sims. Magnus Flamebeard is here. And it's resubscribed for a tier two for twelve months. Thank you, Magnus Flamebeard, for the support. It's good to see you. Also, Liza vs. Soul cheered and said no homo in regards to the last uh, clip of Mass Effect Three. All right. Well, this was twenty four minutes long. I don't know if I put any highlighted. I didn't break down any highlighted times. Apparently, there were funny moments. Let's watch some of this. I don't know if I want to watch all of this. Let's watch some of this. So this one, WWE Two K Thirteen. So this is from October 4th, 2013. This is almost, uh, well, a little bit more than half a year uh, before the last video that we saw, right? Um, this was before the new one had come out. This is probably the last Sims I did before the new one came out that same year. Um, and it's probably just me and John. You see there's no webcam. It's because back then we didn't do webcam for anything. All right. Okay, we're back. This one took a little bit longer to set up. Uh, P Polish Frog says, It's a nice YouTube suggests only DSP gaming videos in the sidebar, not troll videos anymore. The reason it does that is because I watched 
DSP Gaming videos during these retrospectives. So the more DSP Gaming videos I watch, the more it's likely to recommend DSP Gaming videos. If you didn't notice, at the beginning of today's retrospective, there was videos from the quartering. Well, I've watched one video from the quartering, but that's the other thing that gets suggested there. <laughs> Magnus Flame, you're doing a 900 bit series. I hope you're doing good. I am. We're having a really fun time today, uh, Magnus, on the stream. I hope you guys are enjoying it so far, the retrospective. All right, yeah, here we go. Get all the competitors together. They were, they were <laughs> lost. We're off site for another exhibition match. Just the series is like barely aged. This is wild. That's I completely we're false. I told that this is going to be broadcast from the Shield Arena. What? At Shield headquarters. Excuse me. Agents of mm -hmm. Shield. That's what I'm being told. Phil Coulson will be the referee. <laughs> the random shake will be the. Uh, Melinda May will surprise. be the announcer. Agents of Shield. Is that even still on TV? Because this was 2013, this is seven years ago. It probably got probably got canceled by yes. now, right? <laughs> All right, so this is going to be a six-man elimination tag match. Yes. Oh my God! What? <laughs> oh! If you don't notice, the audio sounds terrible. It's because YouTube must have matched that song and then completely destroyed the audio. Yeah, YouTube matched that song, recognized it, and then it ruined the whole audio of the video. Ladies and gentlemen, it's Magneto! <laughs> the Ben Intruder Magneto! Uh, ben yeah. Intruder Magneto! Yes! Personal soundtrack. Wow. <laughs> Cut out. His face. <laughs> Very good looking Look McNeil. Hell of it. Uh, Shield Arena, ladies and gentlemen. Angel of Shield's last episode is August 19, 2020. God damn, it ran over seven years. Like Holy shit. Them, you know, they must have done really well then. That was one of the first Marvel TV thousands, shows, right? right? Yes. Huh. Is that Colson right there? Who's that? That's uh, so Sucks the audio's all ruined. Oh my god, they're playing it again. What the fuck? The pose! The pose! Magneto does the pose! Yes! Wow. Swag Nito. It was Swag Nito. Maximum Magnus. So what is this? These are teammates here. Just this yes. Six-man six elimination. Wow. elimination tag. So this will be his teammate coming out next. Who will yeah, it be? I don't know. Good <laughs> juggernaut. Yeah, right. Oh, oh my God. God. What the? It's the that juggernaut, look, bitch. That looks shitty. Wow. Looks like he's a milk this dud on his head. A melted milk dud stuck yeah, on his I face. Was, what is that? Ugh. No, no, this is a metallic helmet. What are you talking it about? Look like a helmet to me. It looks like some sort of a, it's like a squashed milk dud. <laughs> I just said that. <laughs> yeah. I just said that. The juggernaut, bitch. Good old juggernauts. This is a song. It's all epic. Yeah. Oh, of course, I remember the Dream Driver, the epic glitched move in the game where Brotherhood people float around dickheads. the ring. The Dream Driver. Right. Very, nice. Very good. Who's next? It's a good teammate to have, sure or not. Look at his ass, you can see that. <laughs> what the hell? His anus is a vacuum seal. No, no, his beard wasn't Tony Chimmel. Oh my god. <laughs> he's gigantic. That's the juggernaut. Of course he's that big. It's the juggernaut. He can't, he, he can't pass a wellness test. <laughs> well, I don't think the Jim of Sutterak tests well for drugs. That's the thing. Bzz. I don't know. You know? It's their third teammate here. The Jim of Sutterak. Is it Sutterak? I don't know how to say it. I don't know anything. Okay. He's smiley venom. He's very smiley. Look at that. Yes! It's him! Ladies and Lies gentlemen. Soul the music. That the music's very low. Yeah, Lies for Soul Cheer. I believe the Grinch is a two-time King of Christmas champion. He is. He absolutely is. Girls will take them on. Oh, it's a minute. classic oh, X-Men theme. Whoa! Oh, my God! Scott Summers. Yeah. The Cyclops is here. This is the classic X-Men theme from the, the, the cartoons of the 90s. Awesome Cyclops. Yeah. Yes. Oh, he's more badass now. Run his own pyro. Yes. Do 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 do
The epic X Men team is too good. The leader, well, the former leader of the X Men. Many people say it's Morph. Could be Morph. You never know. Could be anyone. He Morph could be Venom. Morph could be Venom. Morph could be You don't know. The 90s X-Men cartoon was so good. It was right in line with the comic books at that time, that's why. Tiz Waz, subscribe for two months. He's got to go. Wanted to drop a sub before I left. Have a great stream. Thank you, Tiz Waz, for the support. Appreciate that. And ended on cue. That was perfect. Who's next? I don't know. What the hell is this? Oh. What? A fellow X-Men, ladies and gentlemen. It's the motherfucking ever-loving Wolverine. That ain't Hugh Jackman, that's the real deal. Right. <laughs> yes. <laughs> very good. Right. Over. Who's next? I'm not done. I don't like the oh, Wolverine Emo, very so nice. He's replaying it. Yes. The Hit Wolverine replay. Emo. So <laughs> and it matches the character, it's the yellow Wolverine. Right. So we've got Cyclops, we've got Wolverine. Maybe someone to neutralize Venom. Who could be the final team? Oh See you God. later, Moonwalk, man. Thanks for stopping by today. The is going to be. Bucky. What? Bucky will be the Maybe final team. Bucky. What? No. Who is it? Oh. oh, shit. Oh, yeah. This is the best Spider-Man theme, too, from the 90s Spider-Man oh, yes. cartoon. yes. Ladies and gentlemen, straight out of the 1990s cartoons, it's Spider-Man. Peter Parker the Spider-Man. Yes. Beautiful camera angle here. Look at this. Oh, very nice. The, the audio is not synced events. anymore, you know this day? <laughs> the audio is not synced. The reason is when YouTube fucked up the audio to get rid of this stupid bed intruder song, it desynced all the audio on the video and there's no way to fix it. The audio is forever desynced on this video. Which sucks ass. Like, I hate to say it. Like, I like watching this, but I don't even can watch it because watch this. It's all going to be desynced. That's Samuel L. Jackson's Why is there Samuel? Marvel logos? Do they even know what that is? Like, the characters themselves? Of course they do. They don't know what Marvel needs. Look <laughs> Magneto! Look what he's doing! Yeah. The, the video's ruined. YouTube ruined the video. We can't even watch it because the audio is completely desynced. That's what I hate. That's why I tell you guys I'm so upset that my earlier playthroughs were ruined because YouTube just decided one day oh we have an edict that now you can't use any of this music anymore in videos even if you played a video game that had licensed music in it oh we're just gonna fuck your video over and, and completely desync the audio and ruin it you know it's completely unwatchable the audio doesn't sync. i'm very angry about this seriously anyway <sighs> enough about that i guess we'll, we'll move on I'm, I'm now i'm angry I was having a good day. Now I'm upset because YouTube sucks shit. And that's why I don't fucking use it. Unless I absolutely have to. All right. This one apparently is from the NBA Jam reboot. Which I completely even forgot it ever existed. NBA Jam rebooted in 2010. Oh my god. In 2010. And here I am playing it. And apparently there's an epic bug. So we'll start around 2.30. Dude, can't stop him. What the October fuck? October 2010. Here we go. Makes the pass. Oh my what? god. What? That's ludicrous. Bitch. I want his ass. One minute remaining in the first. Oh. Just away with those elbows. pushed back. Strips the ball. Jam it in. Oh, oh my, my god! god. This is medium difficulty. They stop every fucking shot. Yeah. Oh! What the fuck? Shit. They stop every shot, they make every shot, and you can't shoot for shit. This is medium no difficulty. No pass, pass. Ellen, oh my god. Look out. Ellen. Oh he my still god. didn't make it? Oh he still god. didn't make it. Oh my god. Oh my this is ludicrous. This is insane. This is insane. Medium, Medium difficulty. difficulty. 
dumb. What happens on hard? Do they have guns and they just shoot you in the fucking mouth? You play a game on hard. Holy fucking crap! Oh my crap, god! You play one on hard. Yeah, this sucks. The money shot, this is nowhere near as good as the original. Wow. Come on, Fresh Prince. Loses control of it. Shoot. Long two. Oh, long two. Long, long two. two. Long two. Long two. Long yeah, two. So long it should be three points. Fast. Alan. Oh, my oh God. terrible. Stop them. I cannot stop them. Look at that wide open. This is it. You Finally. Oh my god, at least we're coming back. We both tried to miss. We both fucking tried to walk right through. <laughs> NBA Jim Champion Edition was the best. I agree, Rockstar. It really was really good. That's a passive. Oh my god. This is ridiculous. Oh my god. It's ridiculous. Oh my god. Shoot, dude. Here's Alan. It's a shoot. This game makes the three. It's going crazy. Wow. Crossover. Ellen for three. No way. Yes. Oh wow. Who's wow. gonna makes that shit? Huh. Yes, I did play NBA Jam in 2013 to prepare for a tournament. It was part of the ScrewTech uh ScrewTech gaming convention. Uh did a Hold on. ScrewTech gaming convention did a Iron Man of Gaming tournament. And when I went there in 2013, yeah, so I, I, this was one of the events. I ended up getting, I think I was like second or third place in the event. I didn't win it, but I did pretty good in it. I know. Uh, can I change your guy? Oh, yeah, you can. There you go. Right. He's a Garnett. Fucking, might as well be. Yeah. 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 I wonder if we win this game. <laughs> we watch it. Yo, Garnett looks retarded. Giant. <laughs> Here's the hook. They have to make Garnett oh, looks so silly. Looks like a fucking. He's like a giant. Nigerian. <laughs> oh, I, I pressed fast. Uh, Dude, I pressed fast. Wide open. The game knew it. Knocked out of his hand. Good ball movement there. Whoa. That was a good, a good pass, but a terrible shot. Get it in. Dude, the shots missed terribly. Oh my God. No, we can't. They still got it. Look. Oh, okay. we, we, can't. we stole the ball. We knocked them down. You can't get anything. This is this is absolutely ridiculous. Well, Boo Web to me dollars says, "Hey, does this game come with a coupon for fried chicken too?" No, that was that was only Afro Samurai, which we watched earlier on this retrospective. This one didn't come with it. <laughs> this one wasn't that racist. Oh my god. <laughs> we oh, cannot shit. get the ball. Nice. Whoa! That didn't look like it was going in. Uh -oh, oh yeah, Derek's just Garnett, Pierce, and Ray Allen all retired in the last decade. It's been 10 years since this video. Boom, suck a dick up. With the long range jumper. Wow. You're like shooting like looking bad, man, are you? Back up defense here. What the hell? Stupid alley oops. I never understood how to do this. Can he do it? Can he do it? So, fucking jams it in. What? What? 
We need to pass the right to him. Pass it, pass it. Oh. Hey, finally a jam. Finally. Oh. Nice. Oh, this is a super jam. No. Three points. Wow. This shit. So I, I'm gonna assume we won this thing. We figured, we figured out a way to do it. Oh my god. Oh my god. Bullshit alley sure. oops. Fucking okay, Orlando Bloom is amazing. Sure. Of course. Yeah, neither of us could stop there. him. Double defense, we can't ball, stop him. Wow, I can speed the fuck out of it. Whoa! <laughs> Steal it five times and they still get the ball back and score. It's so stupidly broken. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, my god. oh my god. This sucks and I get the ball back. To the open man. Why the hell is Kimmy stop the alley oops? Can't stop the alley oops at all. Wow, dude, he's Damn. really good. Oh, what? Oh, of course he immediately gets it back. What? They get... Okay. Dude, this game sucks ass. I'm up in his fucking ball. This game sucks ass. You knock the guy down, and the ball's like glued to his hand, and he never loses it. In real NBA, when you, someone gets fall, falls down, does the ball stick to their fucking hands and ass so they can't lose it? This game sucks. This game pisses me off just oh, watching I'm it. I'm up in his balls and I can't stop That's it. Can do. Look at that. Look at this game's stupid. Hook shot. That was a little hook shot. Hook shot. Hook shot. What the fuck? Do you see that? Watch out. Send you push back. him, you get the ball. What the fuck? What the fuck? Why did I spin? Wow, that was far. There's only two though. Jesus. I didn't do that. Yeah. Ha ha. Don't fuck. Is this for the Wii? I guess so, Derek. I don't remember. Probably is on the Wii. It's harder that way because it's like you go for the ball. Swish. Wow. So they go for the ball. Oh, you go for the ball and it's loose, and they just get it back and you score easily. Yeah. So it's like worse. Here's Beasley. Bunko. Love stuck down. Once again, doesn't lose the ball. Jesus Christ. How are you supposed to stop that? Cannot stop him. You knock him on his fucking ass. He the ball's glued to him, and then he just jams it, and you can't get the ball out of his hands. Wow. The fadeaway. Fucking threes are you made. Fadeaway tray. We both pushed both arms of your body. He gets the rebound? What the fuck? Alan. Oh my god. <laughs> Thank God for Alan. It wasn't for Alan. Fuck that. Go, go, dunk it. Jam it, jam it. Oh, what? What the fuck? Oh my god. Whoa, have port. Why not? It didn't even look right. Well, we, we won it. We won the game. But the game's broken as shit. <laughs> Always Alan. Sweet spot. Nice. Alright, we, we got the good teams. That was interesting. I don't even remember playing this game. I really don't. So, so many random things that John and I played over the years. I don't even remember, right? Alright, how about this? Let's do something a little different. Alright? Let's do something a little different. We're watching a lot of gameplay. Instead of gameplay, how about this? I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to split the video here. But I want to go down memory lane in a way we haven't done yet. Okay? Let me see if I can find it. Hold on. Where the hell did I put it? Here it is. So what I'd like to do, this is going to be completely unique and different. All right? We are going to go look at my old channels on YouTube and you might be saying well how are we gonna do that well 
There's this thing, I think it's called like the Web Web Archive or Web, I forget what it's called, like the Web Wayback Machine or something like that. And certain pages get archived in this thing. It could bring up how things used to look on the web a long time ago. What we're going to do is we're actually going to go through this index where we're going to look at all the old layouts that my YouTube channels used to have. Some of you may have never seen this. Maybe some of you never used YouTube back in the day. You have no idea what YouTube used to look like, right? Uh, for some reference... Oh, well, we'll do this. I'm going to split the video. And then we're going to get started. Oh, my God. Mm. Mm, my wife is making dinner. <laughs> so I'm, I'm streaming till at least 7 p.m. Right now it's 3.51 p.m. I told my wife, you want to eat dinner early, just make it, and I'll just warm it up later. She's making homemade curry, um, Japanese style. She's not making Indian style, she's making Japanese style. She's done this before. It has pork, potatoes, sweet onions, all kinds of seasonings. It's so effing good. And she's making it right now, and it just hit me. And now, oh my god, that's so good, I want to eat. <laughs> but I can't. I got a cute streak. <laughs> I'm going to be tortured by the smell of amazing homemade curry for the rest of this stream. Okay. All right. Let's split the part for YouTube. Here we go. Uh, 